Hey family and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be trying out this Caribbean hair growth secret to grow long natural hair. We're going to be making use of cactus. Did you know that cactus has incredible benefits for hair? Cactus has many potential benefits for hair due to its high nutrient content. Its benefits include promotion of soft, strong, healthy hair and faster hair growth with less hair loss it also has anti-inflammatory properties that are similar to that of aloe vera because of its high levels of antioxidants it provides relief from itchy and inflammatory scalp conditions thus promoting hair growth while preventing hair loss so first i started by using this candlelight to burn this prickly thing from the cactus because this cactus I have around my area is the prickly cactus so I try to remove it and it actually took time so I held something there to protect my hair. one hour later so now that I've removed the spiky thing off from the cactus it's time to dissect it and get into the business of today Cactus plants are great at storing moisture and it makes sense because they are survivors as they thrive in harsh conditions of the desert. The essential minerals and vitamins help keep your hair by nourishing individual strands and follicles for growth and development. Cactus are a great source of vitamin C, E and A. They also contain iron, calcium and potassium. So I just went in with the cactus to cut it into tiny bits so that it can be easier for my blender to blend. Can you see how slimy this stuff is but not as slimy as aloe vera. It is moisturizing and it makes a great conditioner due to its high concentration of vitamin which is one and a half times as much as the popular argan oil. The fatty acids and proteins makes it possible to get shiny full hair that you are looking for so if you have dry damaged and brittle hair cactus water can or juice can come to your hair's rescue so i'll go ahead and put the tiny pieces of the cactus inside the blender and blend with um, a little bit of water and i'll continue to blend until i'm totally done with all of it So now that I'm done with the blending, I will just go ahead and sieve this juice using a wee cap. You can go ahead and use a cheesecloth if that is what you have, but I'm going to use a wee cap to do this. If you've watched my moringa video then you would know that this is very therapeutic to watch and if you have watched up until this point please go ahead and give me a huge thumbs up because it helps me out a lot on my youtube channel so this is what we sieved out from the cactus and i don't know if they can use this as a mask but personally i wouldn't use this because i don't know if it if it will get stuck in my hair so i'm going to just throw that away and sieve and put this um juice into the spray bottle i use an extra sieve just to sieve any of the um, chaff if i didn't sieve them in using the wick cap earlier Okay guys, so now let's move to the fun part, which is the application part and also the messy part. <laughs> so this is my juice. Look at how green and lush. Alright, so I'll go ahead and remove the twist I had 
in my hair I'm going to remove all of them go ahead and spray water on my hair before applying the um, cactus juice because I just feel that it's 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 better to apply to I mean to spray water because it will absorb more of the um, cactus juice so yep so if you're ever going to recreate this or use this cactus juice for your hair to promote hair growth please go ahead and comment in the comment section i would like to know anybody who wants to try this out and if you ever do it you can tag me on your uh, instagram or even on youtube so i can see what you came up with or how you did the whole process all right so let's continue with it so i just go ahead and detangle my hair gently before i spray some water and then walk the water through my hair you know the usual stuff yeah so when i do this when i'm done with detangling finger detangling it i did not use a comb throughout this process because i didn't just see the need for it okay so i now go ahead and pour the um, cactus juice to my hair so just watch what it would do to my hair in a in a bit So as you can see the whole thing came out really well i can see my corals popping and i know that i made it a little bit watery so next time if i'm going to try this again i'll make it a little bit you know not on the watery side so i can see how my hair will um how respond to it So finally I'm done with this whole procedure and I'm going to just put a plastic um, cap anything you have to use just to, pro to provide heat I'm going to do that right now so I'll leave it to sit on for about 30 to 45 minutes and I'll wash it so guys that'll be all for this video if you really enjoyed this video please go ahead and give me a huge thumbs up that helps me out a lot on my youtube channel and if you like everything natural hair DIYs then this is the channel for you please go ahead and subscribe